side swipe. You're supposed to catch me. That's the whole point of a trust exercise. Oh, now my comm unit is busted. Oh, sorry. Maybe when it was my turn, you shouldn't have let me fall three times in a row. That's because you weren't falling correctly. Hey! Why don't you demonstrate how to fall right, your dictatorship? Hey, knock it off. These exercises are important. Yeah, why can't you guys take anything seriously? Oh, uh, yeah. Um. <clears throat> <laughs> If we're gonna work together to recapture all the escaped Decepticons, we have to learn to trust each other. I do trust Sideswipe. To mess up. <laughs> Fix it to Bumblebee, Strongarm, Sideswipe, and Grim, 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 Grim. Go ahead, fix it. Can you circle back to the scrapyard? There's something I need to show you. On our way. Now let's see if we can all make it back in one piece. Don't feel bad. It's not that easy to be a model teammate like me. instruments have located a cluster of fugitive signals near here, and it appears there might be intact stasis pods as well. <sighs> Some easy captures would be nice. Mayday! Mayday! Oh, we're intercepting an Earth-based radio signal. This is Captain Royal Tank of Windward, off coast of Crown City. We are under attack by what appears to be a shark, but it's bigger than any I've seen, and it looks to be made of metal. Decepticon. My crew has evacuated two lifeboats. Please send assistance immediately. The Alchemore's prisoner manifest lists a Sharkticon aboard. Here's your capture device, sir, and it will work this time. Are you sure? <laughs> Not really. <sighs> Denny, do you have a boat Grimlock and I can tow to the water? Take your pick. You and the Dinobot? Grimlock proved to me earlier today that it can be trusted in a field situation that requires teamwork. You two will check out those fugitive signals. Together. Yeah, work on that teamwork. The stasis pods are at grid 4023 vector 7650. Oh, and bring me back something, will you? A rock or a soil sample or... Where'd you learn to drive a boat? I've spent a lot of time on this planet, remember? But I I'm thinking we're not positioned right. No humans or Sharkticons in sight. Too bad. I was hoping for some punching. Earth's bodies of water are incredible, Grimlock. And they're filled with more kinds of life than you can imagine. I can't wait to punch some water life. This is the total opposite of the right way. You wouldn't know the right way if it hit you in your optics. You're never gonna treat me as an equal, are you? And you're never gonna take me seriously, are you? I'll calm you when I find something. We can't split up. Lieutenant Bumblebee was very specific. Sideswipe? Sideswipe! Stupid comm unit. Excuse me? Grimlock, no! Come on! Oh. Yeah. Ah. Come on! That's all you got! 
chap. I do not wish your vile stench to cling to my exterior. Kinda wish I was a bigger bot. Who does that punk think he's... Prepare for freedom, brother. Claws in the air! Hello, sister. Did you fall out of the sky, too? I'm so glad we found each other. Decepticon Fugitive, by order of Cybertronian Legal Code, Section 305, you are hereby... Of course, you're confused. I wasn't a prisoner on that ship. I was a guard. Fix-It never said anything about a guard being on the Alchemore. Fix it, yes. Well, he wouldn't have known. I was in stasis also. My pod programmed to wake me in case of a riot. Then why would you have a Decepticon logo? <laughs> You're very well trained, asking excellent questions. The logo is meant to confuse the other. Ah! This is Stormar. I'm under attack. <laughs> My location is... <laughs> Strongarm isn't back yet, is she? Listen, Sideswipe! Oh, and I didn't find any stasis pods. Your equipment must be zots, Motormouth. Sideswipe! What? Strongarm called in. It sounded like she was in trouble, but it was too hard to hear. Then her comm stopped functioning, and I can't track her. Oh, you two split up, didn't you? Scrap. I'll notify Bumblebee immediately. I'll handle it. <laughs> <laughs> You have forced me to walk on two legs, like some foul land dweller. How dare you! I didn't realize it was an issue. Listen, Sharktacon. My name is Hammerstrike, Cybertron's most feared pirate, and soon the ruler of all this planet's seas. Yeah, okay, whatever. Look, surrender now, or when my partner returns, you'll probably take a beating. Then surrender. <laughs> <laughs> surrender to the likes of you. I would never be able to show my fins in the gorge and depths again. <laughs> I'm sure that would leave a big hole in your social calendar, but we're still bringing you in. Any time now, Grimlock. What are you looking at? to touch my tail! Guess you took a beating after all. <laughs> Even in your element, I am your superior. Do not pursue me, or I shall prove it again. <sighs> now your ground stitch will be on me for weeks. <laughs> Grimlock, can you hear me? Can you get to shore? Where is everyone? Oh, uh, let's see. Denny Clay went for supplies. Cadet Strongarm and Sideswipe are still out on alignment, advisement, assignment. And I'm not sure where young Russell is. So, how did your mission go? Uh. 
Oh, Grimlock got a bath out of it. I need to know more about Sharktacon so we can predict where this one might go next. Huh, let me see. Salium removal, scar data, self-repairing actualizers. <laughs> Speaking of salium removal, did I tell you about the time I got my head stuck in a focus? Uh, shadow casting. Ooh, Sharktacons. The database says Sharktacons live in highly viscous fluid environments, can swim at high speeds, and have multiple rows of shark teeth. Yeah, I noticed that. Okay, so Hammer Strike wants to control this planet's oceans, but why would he start by attacking an oil tanker? Unless he wasn't initiating his campaign just yet. He was trying to recreate his home environment. All right, look, run a search. See if there are any other nearby sources of crude oil. Oh, there's a short, 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 short... Shoreline refinery within just a couple of miles of here. Human personnel? Mm-mm, fully automated. Sorry about before. Everyone makes mistakes, Grimlock. But keep in mind, just because you've taken the first step doesn't mean you've won the race. Okay, how many steps are there? <sighs> Where are we? An old ranger station. See? Glow in the dark paint. Rangers use it to mark off limit areas during hunting season. But no sign of Teamy McTeamwork. Someone's been here recently. This chain snapped clean. And from the skid marks, it looks like the truck was yanked around by something big. Won't matter if we find strong arm. She'll still treat me like scrap. My dad always says, you want to get respect, you have to give respect. One of you just has to take the first step. That's all. Oh, oh, ah. <laughs> you still don't understand. I want to help you. I'm sorry I lied. I didn't know if I could trust you. Yes, I am a Decepticon, but I've changed. Into a kidnapping Decepticon? I apologize for the things I've done, but I can never go back to Cybertron. I'd be locked up again just the way you wanted to jail me before I could explain anything. I was just... But on this planet, I can begin anew with fellow prisoners who feel the same way, in peace. Now, is that so wrong? I don't trust him. He's too cool. Kind of reminds me of someone. So, what do we do now? If I was half the criminal strong arm thinks I am, I'd just walk away. <gasps> what are you doing? Making you a criminal. Come on. <laughs> okay, we split up just for now. If you find Hammer Strike, what do you do? Start punching. Call you, then start punching. <sighs> Forced to walk the land twice in one day. Uh, thank the cunnings others can't see me now. Hey, what? <laughs> But giving you a second chance isn't up to me. I'm just a cadet. My superior officer would have to be the one to... I would love to meet your superior officer and the rest of your squadron. Uh, how many of you are there? Where are you based? We're just over by the... Wait. How do I know this isn't a trick? I see you found an Autobot. Can I get in on a little payback? Greetings, brother. I'm Steeljaw, and you are? Oh, I'm... <clears throat> I'm... Grimby. 
I'm glad you are free, Grimby. Step into the light and join me. What, uh, what happened to your mark there, uh, Steeljaw? <clears throat> Brother? I destroyed it, and its tracking mechanism. The Autobots mustn't capture me before I can prove to them that I have reformed and want to live here now, peacefully. As I'm sure you do, too. <gasps> Get out! Go! Me? No, no, I, I'd never give up doing crime things. No, besides, I, I hate the Autobots, especially know it all cadets. Am I right? Oh, cadets can be wonderful, if used properly. Tell me more about yourself, Grimby. How were you captured? How was I captured? Well, it, uh, it was a dark and stormy night. Grimlock! Let go! <laughs> I never tire of watching dust grubbers fall all over themselves. One more triumph of sea of the land. One more tuna in a can. What's the matter? I never got to punch him. Ah, oh, cheaters! You cannot beat a sea champion in a fair fight! Feel better? A little. What are you? Besides strange. Look who's talking! <laughs> Don't go near him, brother. Treachery. How like you Autobots. Bad feeling we're gonna see that con again. I hope so. Get that strong arm! You're all right! Why wouldn't she be? Hey, what'd I miss? I was having a little communications difficulty earlier, Lieutenant. Nothing serious. Anything to report? We found some open pods, sir, and a Decepticon. Calls himself Steeljaw. Says he wants to live peacefully on this planet with like-minded Decepticons, but he got unpeaceful with us pretty quick. Can't wait to meet him. I'll go put this one away. And I'll do it gently. The sea! It calls to me! If he's lying about going straight, we could be looking at a Decepticon army trying to take this planet. It's all the more reason to wrap these fugitives up fast. I'll have Fix-It prep a report on Steeljaw's background. He's now on the top of our most wanted list. Good intel, newbies. Well, apparently I can send you to the field together. 
Thanks, Russell. You really saved my spark back there. Uh, you're welcome. What? Hey, I put my gears on the line for you too, you know. Fine, you're, you're never gonna... Thanks, and don't get cocky. That first step we talked about in the woods, I think it's been taken.